First, all new at six, we are putting you on alert after a violent showdown outside the epicenter. A young man says this weekend he had to use a knife to fight off some attempted robbers. Two of the three suspects are now in custody, but this is just the latest violent crime taking place in the heart of the Queen City, and it has more and more people worried. NBC Charlotte's Alex Shabbat joining us live. Alex, you talked to the victim today, and he says he was just trying to do the right thing. That's right, Fred. The 20 year old victim tells us he was getting his wallet out to give the suspects money like they just asked. That's when they tried to rob him right behind me by the steps you see, but he was ready to defend himself. I was walking past the epicenter, headed towards the Spectrum Center. This 20 year old photographer says he was looking for the right spot. Go take a couple photos for the night. But instead, Jonathan Thomas's story giving us a snapshot of the crime around here. He says a group of suspects approached him near this parking garage. They asked me for some money to get something to eat. As soon as I got my wallet out, they tried to take it from me. Thomas, a former Marine, says he fought back. And one of them tried to put his hands on me a little bit, and I took the knife that was on my backpack and kind of pressed it against the main guy's throat, and they kind of backed off after that. It comes just weeks after another victim defended themselves near the epicenter. Police say he chased down a suspect who robbed him. I have attempted robbery, carjacking victim. A fight broke out, and the suspect took off. Police say the suspect returned to the scene an hour later and opened fire on the victim, but did not connect. A short time later, officers arrested 22-year-old Reggie Pettis. If we have that guy detained, then we can call the park and get clear. In light of the latest cases, we did some digging. CMPD crime mapping shows 89 crimes within a quarter mile of the epicenter in just the past month. That includes robberies and assaults. I'm 110% uh, supportive of carrying any type of weapon, especially downtown now, because, you know, that could have saved my life. In the latest robbery, police arrested 17-year-old Sean Priest, Ivy Greer, and 19-year-old Joel Whitley. Thomas says officers were not far away and got the suspects quickly. Made me feel really good about the police presence that was down there. We also asked police what happened to that third suspect, but they tell us they can't give us any information about that at this point in the investigation. Live in Uptown, Alex Shabad, NBC Charlotte. Alex, thank you.